Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to replace your glass and LCD screen assembly on your Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus. Alright, so I'm going to be showing you how to take it apart and place a screen on it. First thing we're going to need to do is we're going to need to give it some heat on the back cover to remove it so we can either do this with a heat gun or a hair dryer uh, by moving it around slowly uh, keep it around uh, around four or five inches away from it so we don't burn the phone or we can put it on a hot plate like I am going to show you this is what I do since I have a hot plate and I will put it to about 110 degrees Celsius for about two to three minutes and make sure that you power the phone off before we begin to give it heat and then once we're ready we'll begin the procedure and then i'm going to show you how to remove the back cover once uh, it's hot enough all right so what we're going to do is we're going to get a suction cup and begin to pull up on the back glass until you see a slight opening where we can stick a uh, pick or prying tool and then once you have the prying tool in there uh, you can remove the suction cup and then we're going to go around the back around all the sides uh, with uh, the prying tool or several prying tools Okay, once you see that you have uh, most of it, the prying tool going around the entire frame, once you see you have most of it uh, lifted up, you can go ahead and pull up on the back uh, glass from the bottom towards the top, and it will come right out. All right, so let's remove, uh, let's remove the adhesive, uh, and let's place it back in place on the back cover so that we can reuse it again. All right, next thing we're going to need to do is remove all of the Phillips head screws that are holding on the back uh, frames of the phone. So we're going to remove all the Phillips head screws and put them to the side. All right, next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna pry up on the uh, back frame. We're gonna pull up on them and gently, they will come right out when they unclip. It's gonna have a little bit of adhesive tape there. You're gonna pull up on it and it will come right out. And then on the bottom um, portion, we're also gonna have to pry up on it gently, maybe wiggle it. Um, sideways so it can come out easier there you go and it'll come right out so next thing we need to do is disconnect the battery to make sure there's no electricity going through the phone all right next thing we want to do is get the new screen so that we can test it out before we um, install it completely uh, so let's go ahead and make sure the phone's uh, powered on let's disconnect the old LCD and connect the new one all right and then once it's connected go ahead and uh, press the power button so that the screen can light up so we can test out 
the LCD and the touch function. All right, so it looks like the LCD is lighting up correctly. So let's test out the touch function as well to make sure that's working. Okay, once uh, you're ready, go ahead and disconnect the battery again to disconnect the electricity and disconnect the LCD, ca the LCD cable. All right, so next thing we're going to need to do is we're going to need to give it some heat again. Once again, this time on the screen, uh, either use a hairdryer, heat gun, or place it on the hot plate until it's hot enough. All right, so once it's hot enough, we're going to get a open prying tool once again and begin prying up. Uh, you can start towards the top. Remember that the flex cable is going to be towards the bottom on the right-hand side. So we're going to begin to pry up on the top portion, pu pulling up. And this is a broken LCD screen, the one we're removing, so I'm not going to be too gentle with it uh, because I don't, don't care about it breaking. <laughs> So we're going to go around the entire screen, all right, until it's completely removed. All right, once you see that the top portion is removed, uh, that you can stick the finger in there, you can begin to pry up on it completely, pull up on it harder so that it comes off easier. This this uh, the S8 and S8 Plus does have a stronger adhesive holding the screen in, I noticed, than the previous models. Alright, next thing, once you remove the, the screen off completely, uh, we're going to make sure that there's no leftover glass around the frame. So that we, when we install the new screen, it won't be damaged by anything left over on the old frame. So make sure you clean it up. Make sure on all the sides there's nothing left. All right, once it's clean uh, and you're sure that you're ready to put the new screen in, let's go ahead and remove the uh, plastic films from the new screen. All right, and we're going to go ahead and place the LCD cable in first through the slot. Also, make sure you put some tape uh, on the uh, new LCD where the chips are to make sure that there's no contact with the frame because sometimes that makes the phone, the screen malfunction. All right, so once that's ready, place the cable in through the slot, okay, and then position the frame correctly on the frame, and then give it some little bit of pressure around all the sides so that it can uh, be glued down with the adhesive correctly. Go around all the sides. All right, once uh, the screen is positioned incorrectly and you have connected the flex cable, connect the battery back as well, connect the LCD cable, make sure everything is connected. All right, uh, you may want to give it a little bit of pressure one more time to make sure that the screen fits in correctly. And then we're going to begin placing the back cover pieces back on. So the loudspeaker on the bottom here. You can place a screw down to secure it. Okay, and then we're going to place the top portion over here. 
which is where the wireless uh, cable, wireless adapter cable goes. All right, and let's go ahead and place all of the Phillips head screws back on the entire uh, back frame. All right, so once you have all the back, the screws back in, we're gonna need to connect uh, the cable here. All right, this is for the sensor, the fingerprint sensor on the back. So we're gonna need to connect this on the motherboard first before we put the back uh, glass back on. So let's connect that. Place it there very gently and slowly. Uh, you may wanna press it down with something, uh, maybe a small screwdriver. Once you, your shirt's clicked in, uh, you can go ahead and just give pressure around the back housing, the back uh, glass, so that it can go back in its place. All right, so make sure that uh, the phone is, uh, the back glass is back on correctly. Once you're done, you can go ahead and power the phone on, test it on, and make sure that everything is working fine. All right, so uh, that's how you replace the LCD screen on your Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus. Hope this video was helpful. If it was, please give it a like and subscribe for more videos like this. Till next time. Peace.